I was trying to essentially say to people, hold your horses, because I think that once he explains what's happening behind the scenes, you will, you will realize that he's not talking about all Jewish people in the entire world. He is feeling passionately about certain people that he works with. And here is what I said in an attempt to get people to hold their horses. Take a listen. That was the tweet. And people subsequently demanded that the tweet be taken down for anti-Semitism. Now, if you are an honest person, you did not think this tweet was anti-Semitic. You did not think that he wrote this tweet because he hates or wants to genocide Jewish people. This does not represent the beginning of the Holocaust. That's if you're an honest person, you'll admit that, you will admit that, right? If you're an honest person, when you read this tweet, you had no idea what the hell he was talking about. I had, I had no idea when I read this tweet what the hell he was talking about. This tweet inspired questions, not answers. First and foremost, what is DEFCON 3? Did he mean DEFCON 3? which would be a military defense position, not an offense for those